this is the url for the think and link learning environment once you arrive at this page you will have to create a username for yourself let's say for example i create a username please provide an email id as well as a password once you create an account you use the username and the password to log in once you log in you will arrive at this page where you see the phase that you are in the introduction phase you have the pedagogical agent who will give you prompts throughout the learning environment you also have a place that you could write your notes in this video you will be taken through the task which you have to be doing once you complete the task the other tabs will automatically be enabled once you save your answers in this phase you will be provided with the fbs graph as you can see a worksheet where you will have to complete a set of tasks as well as a uml diagram corresponding for the fbs graph once you complete the worksheet question and answers this phase will end in the introduction phase you are required to look at the fbs graph explore the fbs graph via the various interactions possible complete the answers in the worksheet once you complete all the answers and explore the fbs graph the end phase will be visible and as you end this phase you will be moved to the next phase which is the induction phase in the induction phase similar to the introduction phase you are required to look at the video find the objectives in the phase as well as how would you incorporate the learnings in the software conceptual design you will have to complete these answers and then the next tabs will be enabled once you save your answers you the other tabs will be automatically enabled in this phase you are required to not only explore the graph but edit the graph by adding functional structure behavior nodes and connecting them the pedagogical agent will provide prompts at various phases as you edit the graph after having edited the graph you can evaluate your fps graph based on the evaluation parameters provided in this wheel you will have to look at the evaluation parameters assign corresponding categories and also at the same time reflect on why you are giving the particular rating you can go back and edit the fps graph and come back and evaluate the fps graph once all the evaluation parameters have been completed this phase will end after you have edited the fps graph and evaluated this phase will end you are then taken to the third phase which is the ideation phase 
In this phase, similar to the earlier two phases, you will have to complete the planning questions that are provided. In the last phase of Think and Link, you are required to write the design problem that you are interested to create a software conceptual design, create a FPS graph from the scratch, evaluate the FPS graph based on the evaluation parameters in the wheel and then complete this task of creating FPS graph for two problems. Thank you.